Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel once again. My name is Ronald. If you're new here, make sure you like, share, subscribe so you never miss a bite. Today I'm simply talking about the use of gloves because people have pointed out to me uh, to say why don't you use gloves uh, when you're cooking and uh, I actually do. Let's just say I know when to use a glove. So I use the gloves when it's, um, I'm handling raw chicken, raw meat, or, or raw fish of some sort or whatever. But also on the other hand, I do use it, let's say, when I'm picking up some garbage or whatever as well. But the best practice, honestly, goes without saying, is washing your hands. So that you can avoid cross-contamination. Now, when people see me and say, why don't you wash your, wash your hands? And by the way, I'm doing this video out here because uh, in the kitchen was a bit loud and I've tried to do this video a few times now. So let's just say take five. Perhaps. Um, so as you guys can see, if you have your gloves on, I'll show you a little clip. I'm in the kitchen right now. Imagine that you're touching the different equipments. You're touching this, touching that, touching the other. And honestly, if you're not careful enough, you can actually do cross-contamination. Um, so when you see me not using gloves, that means I've washed my hands and every, every now and then I do wash my hands constantly to make sure I'm not making anybody sick. See, that's the key and that's the trick right there to make sure you use them right. I want you to imagine this. Maybe you're going to a sound shop, like say maybe Mr. Saab, Peter Pit, whatever, wherever you may go to where they're making your sandwich and someone pulls out the gloves. But most of the times you find out someone pulls out the gloves, they pull out, they open the drawer and maybe they try now to pick the lettuce. And maybe they you wanted fries perhaps. They they're dropping the fries down with the same hand, right there with your gloves on. So you who do you think those gloves are protecting? So those gloves now are protecting me who is handling the food, not you who is, on, who is going to eat the food. Because if I'm protecting you, I'll make sure I'm using the gloves properly. As I put the gloves, I'm going to put them on, that means I'm handling your food. I'm getting, maybe I now I picked up the wrap from, the, from right there, I'm putting in the vegetables, I'm putting the meat right there, then I roll it, so that means I'm protecting you. At the same time also, I should probably use tongs when I'm picking up all the other stuff. I want you to keep this in mind the next time you go to get a wrap, I'm not trying to turn you off or anything like that, get a wrap or whatever, just watch who is doing it and how they're doing it. Because half the time, it's the same individual trying to do cash, and then from there, you don't see them wash their hands right away. In most cases, you're going to see them touch other things as well. So you tell me. I know people have been saying, oh, use gloves, you should be using gloves. I do use gloves when they call for it. I'm holding raw meat, or raw chicken, or whatever. Maybe I'm cutting onions, I don't want onions in my hands. Yeah, I'll use it. Maybe I'm cutting bits, you know. I'm getting bits in there, you know, how colorful they are. They make your hands go really funny colors, like purple, whatever. So I do use them. So I don't know whether you guys agree or disagree with me, but I suggest that, uh, hey, you look into it before you talk about it well thank you guys i really appreciate you guys coming to my youtube channel as always i do cooking videos here but also diys because i love doing diys and yes i love a challenge okay so having said that i also do actually do a word of the day here so the word of the day is going to be hands in my language we say ngalo 
Ngalo, those are the you know fingers, those are fingers, and then hand will be the corner will be a forehand, a forearm, or hand. Well, thank you guys. I really hope to see my next video, and bye now.